Hello fellow crafters. Sorry about that. I want to share with you. I joined a group um, called the um, Free Spirit um, Secret Sister uh, Box Swap Society. I used to be in the Secret Squirrels and um, Jay decided to uh, take a break for a while. So um, Lisa James, she decided to create her own um, site because there were several ladies that still wanted to do the swapping. So this is what I created for my partner. I won't be showing this until, sorry, I'm in my jammies and it's like 7 o'clock at night. I got home and I decided to get this video done. I almost forgot to do one. I had this already packed up. Um, so I had to unpack it. <laughs> um, won't show this video until I know my partner has it. And our theme was garden. My secret garden. And my partner is Kathy. And Kathy is, um, she lives in Canada. And I learned a little bit about her, that she's, um, an altar artist. And when questions were asked about what kind of garden would you like, um, she mentioned um, she would love to be sitting in her garden um, with her easel and you know stuff like that. Well I couldn't find an easel, I couldn't figure out how to do that. <laughs> so I kept you know looking around and doing some research and I found that she liked the pink paisley butterfly paper and um, that's what I went with. And I cut, this is a, a real cigar box and as you can see the inside and all around I signed it is covered with the paper and the Tim Holtz tissue tape over the edges I did the inside with a um, let's see if I can get that in frame that's a Michaels um, wood bird, ha bird cage and I took a piece of uh, wood out of my um, backyard and then this is a punch, and then these are prima flowers, and some seam binding. Um, wild orchid craft flower there. This is the Martha Stewart butterfly um, that I made using her mold. And we add, I like to add, you know, a trail off my butterflies. And then on the front of the box here, these are the new recollection bird, bird houses. And there's another piece of, um, a wood piece from my yard. And then these are little um, leaves that I punched from a punch. And on the top, let's see, get that in frame. On the very top here, let me bring that up so I can show you. I just added some flowers. I've got um, a Gatsby flower. I think I got that from Saw Crafter. These are Pro 31 flowers. They're just beautiful. Um, this is a, a collection I got on eBay, and I think that's a Prima. And then here's a little bitty bird you get in the dollhouse section at Hobby Lobby. And then this is a tree branch that I cut from my Cricut. And these are the uh, Sweetheart Blossoms from Wild Orchid Crafts. And then some little berries I cut from a stem and some leaves. Um, each leaf I embossed with a stylus and then colored with um, watercolor green pencils. And then this is another one of the butterflies from Martha Stewart's um, molds that I made. And I colored it with a teal and a green and then went washed over it with a um, walnut stain, distress stain inks. Here's another one of the birdhouses that was in the um, set that I got from Recollections, Michaels. Uh, here's another piece, of, a real piece of uh, stick from my yard. And then here's a bench that um, I actually made this. Um, Prima has this um, bench in a mold and I pressed this into FEMA and created a mold. It didn't turn out as well as I wanted to but it, it works. I had to hide some of it over here. So there's my box, and that's for her. And then we had a challenge to do a dress form. So here is my dress form. 
thanks to Liberty. Oh, I know it's Liberty. Oh, Miranda, I can't remember the last of your numbers. I will put a link below to her YouTube channel. No, I'll just put a link below to um, so you can go check out her YouTube channel. This gal is the oh my gosh, she is so creative. She rocks the world. I love watching her videos. She kills me with her creativity. But she had created this uh, dress form with the Tim Holtz die. And I followed her tutorial and made this for my partner. And I used C on the card. And then here's the, the last birdhouse I put there. And then I used some of the Pro 31 bling. This is a Prima flower. This is a Wild Orchid Craft flower. We have a Martha Stewart butterfly on top. And this this is... I can't remember where this trim's from. And then I added a little picket fence around the bottom. And then the bottom is a um, Prima um, clock. And I added a chipboard in the center because I didn't want to waste one of the pieces. And then just put paper on the bottom and then washed over it with a uh, little brown, a uh, distress, walnut stain distress. And that's my dress form. Miranda, I hope I make you happy. Uh, I tried to match the box so it's not, it's not vintage, it's not shabby, it's kind of... Oh, like a garden theme, I would say. So that's from my partner. I hope she likes it. Thanks for watching, and hope you have a great week. Bye now.